Welcome back to the channel my friends, it's Evelyn here as always, but this week I'm broadcasting from this year's Belladrum Tartan Heart Festival. Which begins by getting to the site, and since it's been raining, I'm sporting some very fetching pink wellies, because, well, why not, needs must. my best fuzzy granny attire it's time to pitch that tent and it's a fairy tent of course and the sky passing us by while we were doing just this was simply incredible from home to Belladrum is simply spectacular, there's no other word for it. We are so completely and utterly spoilt here in Scotland with the most stunning scenery. Very, very blessed. Perform a band safely on our wrists, it was time to enjoy the festival with my trusty Mugwai Gizmo backpack in tow. The music and cartoon themed decoration around the festival site at this year's Bella was incredible. And this year's move of the main stage was a bold one that definitely paid off and the atmosphere was truly electric. Without a doubt, Belladrum is my all-time favourite UK festival. It has a much more family-focused feel and despite the traffic congestion, which was heavier than normal this year in particular, the wait is more than worth it. But without further ado, my friends, here are this year's costumes. It's reveal time.
looking at my original sketches and inspiration images, I am beyond ecstatic with how this year's costumes turned out. And the Bella crowd loved them just as much as we did. The chosen fabrics and patterns worked perfectly and were immediately recognisable as the chosen characters. And if you want to make your own cosplays, my friends, there are cards throughout this video and links in the description box to the tutorials so that you can do just that. Belladrum is a highlight of my year every single year, but this year it meant even more. Getting to share the festival with my beautiful daughter after the events of this year was truly special and I'm incredibly grateful that I was able to attend and that my health allowed it. Dynamic disability means that you never know what you're going to be faced with on any given day and this year was even more unpredictable given my recent surgery. So I had to be extremely cautious, look after myself and be incredibly careful with how I expend my energy and how I look after myself, which for someone who is incredibly stubborn like me and doesn't like to accept their limits, yes, it's difficult. But luckily, I have a super supportive family team supporting me physically and mentally and I had an amazing weekend, even if I was completely and utterly spent and exhausted by Sunday. Sometimes it's just about choosing your hard and dealing with the consequences later, especially as a disabled person. But as always, my friends, I try and stay as positive as I can and put a smile on my face. A massive thanks to everyone at the Belladrum Tartan Heart Festival, but especially to the wonderful Jane Litster and her fabulous entertainments team for having us this year. But until next week, my wonderful friends, when it's the start of September, which means a sewing extravaganza to celebrate my birthday, take care, my friends. Stay safe. Bye. Thank you.